girls and guys, it's Presley, and I'm here to tell you that migraines are one of the worst pains I ever felt in my whole entire life. It's one of the things that irritates me the most. It's not the number one thing that irritates me the, the most, but it's one of those things that irritates me the most. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to add an, um, this video to my rants playlist. Because I rant about a lot of things that irritate me. And this is pretty much going to be one of them. So I don't get headaches or migraines that much. But when I did, it was back in 7th and 8th grade. Which was junior high from my personal viewing and experience of headaches and migraines. It's not fun. It's, it's never fun when you get a headache or a migraine. And if any of you guys ever experienced headaches or migraines, let me know in the comments below and let me know what was the worst experience you had with a migraine. My worst experience was obviously, like I said, between seventh and eighth grade. My headaches and migraines, it builds up through stress and my stress goes through like stages. First, whenever I get upset about something, I have a hard time, you know, focusing on something. I always focus on the thing that freaks me out, that stresses me out. Sometimes I cry when I get upset. Don't judge, please. This is how I end up with stress. I cry a lot when it comes to certain things, stress, anxiety, anger, Sadness, all of these emotions build up in my head to make me cry. And I've told you guys once before that I'm emotionally sensitive and that also tends to my stress. So I get upset, I cry, and then the next several hours, depending on how bad my stress is, how bad the subject of what I'm upset about, how bad it is, I start to get a headache. And in the middle of the night, sometimes my headaches get so bad, they wake me up in the middle of the night. Like, it's like a throbbing pain. It's like someone's banging my head against the wall. It's that painful. To the point it turns into a migraine and I start to feel nauseous. And basically, you know where this is going. I start to vomit afterwards. It's that bad migraines are that bad from my point of view and from my experiences. Now, I'm sure you guys dealt worse migraines and headaches than me, but from my point of view, you can see how bad mine are. And if you were in my shoes, then you would probably feel sorry for me at this point, but I'm over them now. I tend to Hand, try to handle stress the best I can. I, again, I'm taking therapy, handling my stress, anxiety, mental and emotional health, like I've said before, and it's going okay. It's not the worst thing in the world. I'm not gonna die, let's hope not. But hey, all, as long as I think of positive thoughts and leave the negative thoughts out of the way, then I'll be good. But the problem is, when I focus on something that stresses me out and I can't think of anything else, I would have to distract myself so I won't think of that thing that stresses me out the most, which is the hard part. And when I need someone to talk to, that's also a hard part because I don't have a whole lot of friends. And when I do have friends, they just text me. That's it. I don't interact with them that much. That's because they're busy. I have two closest friends that are really busy with work. And I'm just here at home just waiting to get a job. A new job, at least. But it'll get there. Again, no need to rush things or pressure me or anything. I'm taking things one day at a time and stress is the same thing too. I folk, I tackle it one day at a time. It's not the end of the world. So how I handle stress is up to me. 
my way of handling things is different from everybody else. Everybody has their own ways of dealing with stress and anxiety. And I made a video about my stress and anxiety if you want to check that out and stuff like that. So anyway, I don't deal with headaches or migraines anymore, thank goodness. But whenever I do, I just let nature take its course and hopefully I get better from it. Now I'm feeling so much better. So haven't had a migraine or headache since, since junior high. Now I'm a young adult tackling things, trying to tackle things by myself. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.